Good morning everybody and welcome to Village TV. I'm Zarina Robertson and I am speaking about how to make an impact with your personal brand because I'm all about branding and this is all about an interview with Lee Usher. She's a social media babe and the co-founder of Buzzweb Media. And today we have got a treat for you, everybody. We're going to be talking about social media. <laughs> and what have we got a treat about? It is about the mistakes that social media, or what we can make the mistakes on social media about. So let's talk Those about that. Those blooper moments. Oh, the blooper moments. <laughs> Gosh, have we seen and read and heard a lot about those. So let's talk about some of these. Okay, well, there's, there, you know, the mistakes that you see, and we've all seen them, we just go, what was she thinking? <laughs> <laughs> and it's the rants, it's those ones where it can be quite hurtful to people. It's, yeah. um, you know, you, you, in the moment, it's like we, in the past we would ring up our friends and we'd just go, oh my God, I just had this blah, 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 and we have the rant, the debrief, and we're done. On the phone, on the, the phone. old good old days, everybody. But now with social media, it's just so easy, and we just and it's like and it's out there, and it hurts people. Mm. And we all look at it and we go, not touching that. Yeah. Okay, computer freeze. And then of course those people have those regrets and they delete yeah. it, but the damage is done. Yeah. yeah, it actually is not really good for your personal brand no. to be in that Perfect. state of mind. And letting go and leashing out on social media, is it? Yeah, so, mm -hmm. so a lot of the time when people make mistakes in using social media, it is in those heat of the moments it can be that they've... Yes. And, and also, like, we all have our ups and downs. We all have our bad days. And, you know, you don't get that deal that comes through or someone's just screwed you over in business or something like that. It happens. Yeah. But um, it, it just... It, putting it on social media, it, it actually damages your brand. Yeah. Because... Um, if people see this rocky road, yeah. you're unstable. Unstable. Do I want to do business with someone who's unstable. Okay, am I unstable? On Monday, <laughs> I was on a plane on Virgin Airlines. <laughs> am I unstable, folks? <laughs> because I put a little rant and I was like, I'm in the aeroplane on the tarmac. I'm going, wow, I'm st cabin fever and we haven't left the tarmac. That it was like a two, an hour and a half later and there was, there was a, because it was a little <laughs> red light on the dashboard in the aeroplane. I'm like, get me out of here. I want to go home. <laughs> no, I love those rants. Those rants are the best rants oh, okay. because they actually add to the who you are and who your personality and this is life. Mm. And those sorts oh, of okay. rants actually don't hurt anybody. Mm. So people actually, it's, it's actually where you get a chance to connect with the people who follow you because if they see you having this, everybody's been stuck on the tarmac. Do you know what I mean? And it's like, so sometimes it's a great way just to diverse from your business space and just be a person. Yes. And, and people will come in and go, oh, yeah, don't you hate that? Yeah, and yeah. It can create a lot of engagement and then connecting with people because they've got something in common with you now. That's right. Yeah. I love being a little bit silly. <laughs> Yes, <laughs> it's a bit of, um, I love being silly and, and insightful and fun. I think it's all part of pers you know the personal yeah. brand and also making that impact on social media. Yes. Now tell me about some other things because I understand there's some you know there, look there's a serious side other to this mistakes. as well. You know there is there's bullying and then there's bad photos. Ooh. So talk and to us about yeah. that. Okay. <laughs> so so you know the rants where the heat of the moment. Um, then there's the bullying. The, the bullying is mm. is where it's very quite strategic. People put things up to be harmful um, you know people you've got you are representing your business and and so if you put that out there and your your circle knows who you're talking about mm. that actually reflects on you yeah. and it can and it's gossip oh. and it's nasty no. and people tend to sort of just if the people that get involved in it um, you know it, it, People then see those. It's the, the, there's this circle that is started, and and so you know, you don't want to be around those people no. because a lot of people just think you know you're negative energy. It's negative energy, yes. and and I avoid it personally. If I see other businesses starting to create these little click groups and talk about someone else, they may not necessarily mention them or or you know. I, I just stay away from it because it's negative. It's yeah. negative energy, and I don't want that as part of my space in social media. I think it's also important with your personal brand that you know that you're congruent in how you mm. come across in your message as well as online and offline. Yes. I think it's a behaviour. At the end of the day, is quite you know what's acceptable and in a way what's not. You can't you can't yeah. be one person 
online and yeah. then someone meets you and it's just doesn't gel like yeah. you know this is why I have my own social media space separate from the company because the company has its own serious identity we work with corporates mm. so but for me I love training and helping small businesses and so there's this fun aspect in it and and, and sort of like the the co more cost effective side of it you know yeah. and just teaching and helping and you know there's a lot of people they they start a Facebook page and they think it's all just going to happen yeah and then they just kind of fumble and work it out I mean that's how everybody started that's right so it's great if they can find me and I can help them that's right photos yeah Shall we touch Fo on photos oh, touch baby touch <laughs> we <laughs> got a massage <laughs> photos photos where do i start like yeah no. when oh. people will put those photos up um, yeah oh there's you know there, there are so many settings in your social media where you, you we're not you don't say don't put them up there's certain photos that you want to have on your holidays and yeah. share them with your friends that's right change that setting not to be public if it's not important the drinking photos the yes. girlfriends away weekend right. sort of things you know you want to share because but but if you're using social media for a professional yes keep it on your personal space Keep it under personal. Yeah. Yeah. A private folder or and you know, access to your friends only. That's a really I clever. I have a friends only photo album. Yes. Um, it's all our holidays because my holidays aren't important to my professional side of my business. So Yeah. 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 Oh gosh, this has been great. Oh look, Lee, thanks for coming today and sharing, you know, quite some fantastic insights on social media. You know, and definitely the the, the don'ts and then the do's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so an integral part of people's professional business, and you, mm. especially if you are a CEO or an executive or someone that's wanting to start to develop a personal brand. Yeah, it's an important vital marketing tool that can be so easily used to access a lot of people. So yeah, I, I hope I don't want to give that idea that mm, it's just too hard. Don't let me in. No, <laughs> so. not at all. But I think you know, it's at the end of the day, it's just behaviour, isn't it? As well, it's and being in tune. Yes, if if you got that gut feeling. Oh, I don't know whether I should. Yeah, don't. No. <laughs> there we go. Thank you, everybody, for uh, joining us today. Thanks, Lee. Thank no you worries. very much. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye, everybody.